Hi guys, it's me, Chris. I'm back. I don't know if any of y'all have heard about what's going on in Texas, but we finally have power back. And we were able to take a shower because, man, was it hot with no air condition. <sighs> uh, yeah, we had, there's, was, there were millions of people without power uh, because of the, I think it was a tropical storm instead of a hurricane. But, uh, yeah. So, um, one thing I wanted to do, I didn't get to do yesterday. I did get to put it on one of her videos, but I wanted to say happy birthday to my friend Tammy, who's in Canada, and I hope she had a fantastic day. Her birthday was yesterday, so this is Tuesday. Her birthday was on Monday. Anyway, this is going to be, it's uh, like a last chance Monday, but this is more along the lines of, am I the only person that isn't exactly thrilled with Sigma? palettes. I mean, I have this one, the Alice in Wonderland. This one I, I enjoyed, but the one I'm about to show you, and you can tell just by looking at it, because my palettes normally don't look like this, uh, this one is Enchanted. Ugh. It looks like I had problems with this one. So, I'm going to try a look with this one today and see if I can come up with something that I like. I'm not going to, obviously, this is, this is a fairly new palette to my collection. Not going to get rid of it, but, well, I don't know. It just it kind of depends on how this goes. Let me get... I'm going to give it the best chance I got. This is a 441, and I would really like a Persona brush, which I should have gotten before I started this, and I didn't. What's this? That's not it. Well, we'll just start going with the Morphe. Okay, I'm going to go into quartz which is you know and just a regular shade that I can put all over so hopefully everybody's doing okay the rain has stopped here it seems like every few years we get absolutely slammed by something and what was weird is I could because I don't sleep that well I was up at about 5 o'clock in the morning I looked outside and I'm like what are they talking about it's not gonna it didn't look like it was gonna rain it didn't look like uh, anything there was no drizzle there was no nothing so I, I went back and I started trying to look at some videos and I actually dozed off for about 45 minutes when I woke up we were getting the holy living you know what slammed at our house. I, I couldn't believe it. Just in the space of the 45 minutes it moved in and it was it was going. So, and then shortly after that we lost power. Um, I really thought, and I know this is stupid, probably. Yeah, I'd say so. Uh, I really thought because we live in a new neighborhood that they would have made provisions to make sure that that kind of thing didn't happen here. I know before anybody says anything. But the reason I thought that is uh, most of our cables and stuff are underground. However, some of the other parts that like the you know those big things I can't think of what they're called right now. Um I'm going into Terra right now, which is this one right here. Uh, they're above ground, obviously, because they had transformers. That's what I was thinking of. And um, so there's that. And I'm just, whoa, okay. I don't remember it being quite this pigmented. Wow. Okay, well. That kind of changes what I'm what I'm doing right now. 
Um, in about 45 minutes, my sister is going to be here, not Kathy, my other sister, and we're going out. I'll see where she takes me, who knows, but I think I might have gotten, I'll fix that in a minute. Okay, uh, I think it's to a Mexican food restaurant that we go to where um, they know us and uh, it's always a lot of fun when we go there. So I think that might be where we're going. I'm guessing she must not have got, gotten flooded. She lives way out in the middle of nowhere. I haven't been there yet, but uh, she's going to be taking me out there eventually. We had it scheduled before something. It was her birthday, maybe. I don't know. Some kind of trip her and her husband had planned, and it ended up not happening. So, all right. They're very, okay, what I've got here, these are very, the only word I can think of is loose. They're kind of, uh, I'm not seeing any fallout, but they feel like they should be. I don't know if that makes any kind of sense to anybody but me, but I know what I mean. Uh, just a second. I got my earring is uh sometimes oh it's my hair i'm not used to have i forgot i'm not used to having my hair down like this okay the, this has a lot of kick up in the pan the, this particular shade does and that might be what i'm you know feeling from it but i don't know i feel like there should be fallout and there isn't any it's really strange well, maybe right. I don't know. Okay, we have that. Now I went for. It's the first time ever, guys. I am not wearing any setting powder on you know my face. I, I have uh, set my under eye, but I'm not wearing any anything on my face. Never done this before, but I used the Fenty tip tint stick that I love so much and I used the say which I'm not that glowy I don't think but uh, it didn't appear that I needed anything okay so I'm sticking with peachy kind of I'll have to reapply my lip but it's like a marigold color um Okay, I, there's this one called Claystone. It's a darker shade right there. I'm going to use that for something. I'm not sure what, but I do want a different brush. Uh, and I thought I had one. There we go. All right. Try to turn the volume down on my phone as low as I could because I'm getting just, I'm so tired of getting these phone calls. And before I got on camera, I mean, literally it was one after another and then they'd be like calling at the same time. So it'd be, you know, one up. Nice. Okay, this one is a little bit crummy. I mean, it's what I want to do, but... Okay, let's try the other side. Totally forgot what I was talking about. Oh, the phone calls. Well, that's an old subject, but I tried to turn it down, guys, so that it wouldn't... Uh... Alright, let's see. There's a lot of sparkles in here. But I figured you guys might be sick of seeing sparkles from me considering the the look I love so so much on my was it my last video. 
it might have been my last video. Uh, speaking of which, I haven't gotten to the comments yet, guys. I will. Uh, you know I will. Um, I just haven't haven't done it yet. Okay. We, let's see. There's one called Innocent. It's this one right here. I'm going to go into that. Oh, th these are really um, super uh, fallout or uh, kick up in the pan. There's a, a, a ton. I'm going to take this all over and kind of blend it in with uh, what I've got going on on the lid right now. So, Sophia, did y'all have any problems in San Antonio? I really don't know how far this thing, I, I just know that we that there were a couple of, of people that passed away during the flood. I don't know how, what, what happened, I guess they got uh, caught up in water or, you know, I'm not sure, but yeah, it's just a bad, bad thing all the way around. Guys, I haven't been this quiet in a video and I can't remember when. What on earth is going on? I have absolutely no earthly idea why I'm so quiet. Okay, I'm going to turn this way. Like, why, I don't even know why I do this. The light is always better when I turn this way. Okay. Yeah, that's about how I want it looking and except for underneath and I'm gonna go ahead there is <clears throat> excuse me <coughs> okay I just I freaked myself out um I don't use <laughs> dough-ended brushes and this is a Sigma oh it came out of I should start over, but I can't. I don't have time. Um, okay, there's what I was going to say is there's a dark green, I think, because it's called the Evergreen. And it's this one right here. And I guess I'm going to use this brush if I, yeah, clean it off. Hopefully this week this this stuff will stop because the what I was telling you about as far as my debt that's probably going to go through and finalize this week. So all these companies will find out about it and will quit calling me. All right. So now I am going to it's going to be a, a sparkly so, I'm going to try and find, I don't know where all my brushes have gone. Uh, we're going to dig into what it's called is Metamorphosis. And it is this one right here. So, i got to get a setting spray. And there we go. Load up the brush. Okay, this looks like it's. Um, uh, all right, this is a really mild. If you can make that out, it's a really mild color but uh, make sure making sure my brush is dry I'm gonna try and pack it on again uh, this must be like a topper maybe it doesn't look like one it, it's making a big fat mess um, Uh, my sister, I just found out from my husband that Magnolia has no power, so um, I'm having to tell her not to come. Okay, guys, I'm not going anywhere, so I guess uh, 
the power is just a little bit worse than what we were thinking. It, it really is a mess down here. Anytime, um, I'll, you know, if businesses is closed, you know it's pretty bad because they, they lose money if they're not open. Okay, all I can say about this, guys, is this is a very mild, very mild, um, sparkly. I think it's uh, probably just a shimmer shade. Um, and not a shimmer, I don't know what I'm talking about. A uh, topper. Oh my gosh. Alright. I feel like it needs something on top. A darker... Okay. Let me clean this. There's one called... Uh, Loam, L-O-A-M, and it's this one right here. I'm going to try and use that for the top part. Let's see if that makes any kind of difference. I don't know what happened the first time. It, it's been, it, it was towards like September of last year. Um, that I got the both of these palettes I've purchased because I'd never used Sigma before and I had heard they had an excellent formula but I tell you when I got these I was kind of underwhelmed but you know everybody has their own feelings about certain things and I wanted to make sure that I was giving it a fair shot That really, I'm going to try it here in a second once I'm, you know, blending a little bit more. And this is with a brush that had nothing on it. Um, I want to see if the, when I, if I use my finger, if it, I mean, you can hardly tell that I have anything on that's, let me see if you can see what this looks like. It looks like it should be sparkly. Let me try. Ooh, feels like hard pan. Okay, I'm doing something I wouldn't normally do. Just kind of scraped off the top just a little bit. Yeah, but I don't know. I. I do not know what what is wrong with that uh, shade. Uh, let's go ahead and go into Cosmos, which is this one right here. And uh, okay, that definitely that added. So what am I doing? Let's go ahead. And, it feels these the mattes feel much more creamy, but when you get to the shimmers or glitters or whatever the sparklies they don't feel they feel hard i don't know how else to describe it um they don't feel like they should okay that oh my goodness now we do have fallout so okay i think that the last thing i'm going to do is I had showed y'all, this will just give me a chance to use this, I had showed y'all this, this thing that I got because I can't help myself, obviously. Uh, but it's got a uh, beautiful, uh, I don't know how I can, it's a creamy type thing, but I'm going to use it for the, uh, just to put a little bit in the inner corner. And I need a tiny brush. This is a 
I think a billion dollar brush, but it's a tiny one. Um, it's time for mascara, and I'm going to go away and come back with the mascara, and then I'll have my thoughts. This has been the weirdest uh, video I think I've done in a long time. I was quiet, I think. I don't know, maybe it's because we just got finished having a humongous storm here. But I will be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, my thoughts. First of all, does anybody else that have a Sigma palette or anything from Sigma? Um, I mean, the brushes they have are phenomenal. That I already knew. And I, some of the people I watch, they rave about Sigma palettes. I don't, and I, I don't know if something was wrong with this one it shouldn't be doing this considering i bought them brand new this is july and so it's six months it's like maybe seven months ago eight months ago um that that's i have palettes that i've had for four years i know that are still you know good um this one came to me and I this particular one enchanted I had a problem with right off the bat um, the shimmers glitters toppers whatever are chalky and they you know they just uh, I've never tried let me try this one called Electrum now see this one doesn't feel like that let's see if it uh, yeah that is a that's a pretty one I'm trying to uh, but then you have okay see this one feels hard as a rock it's called Moonglade maybe it don't And you, it's right next to, I don't know. This palette, to me, I would not recommend it to anybody. Um, even though if you work at it hard enough, like most of the mattes in here are really nice. Really, really nice. It's the problem with the others. They, they're hard and they don't, I mean, I, I don't even know, maybe you can, it's somewhere around in here, maybe, uh, maybe you can see it, I don't know. Um, this one, the Alice in Wonderland, I didn't have any trouble with this one. This one is a beautiful palette, love it, this particular one, the Enchanted, don't love it. Anyway, thoughts, comments, let me know. This is the look. Anyway, let me know what you think. Uh, that's it for today. I'm sorry I was quiet. But that's not like me. You guys know <laughs> if you've been here for a while. You know I usually don't shut my mouth. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Um, just let me know if you maybe even if any of you have had this palette. If you have, did you have the same problems I'm having? I'm not getting rid of it. And I probably will give it another try at another time. So, yeah, that's probably what's going to happen. Anyway, guys, wherever you are, I hope you are well. Take care, have some fun, but stay safe. Watch your surroundings, you guys know. And I will see you on the next video. Bye, guys.